hi, welcome back to the Indie Wellness Center YouTube channel. My name is Brittany Catterjohn, I'm the registered nurse. And I'm Robin Eldib, I'm a nurse practitioner and owner of Indie Wellness. Today we're going to be talking about hypothyroidism. It's often undiagnosed, um, but you'll go in, you'll say you have, have all these symptoms and people will tell you A, it's normal, and B, it's part of aging. And yeah, that's one thing we don't like at Indie Wellness is just the word normal labs. We'd like to go over it thoroughly with you. If you're not feeling well, try to find the root cause for it. Not to mention mm -hmm. with um, thyroid issues, you may not have had all the labs that you need done, which we're going to cover on the next video, but mm -hmm. this one's strictly about symptoms of hypothyroidism and what it can look like. So Brittany's going to demonstrate for us the thyroid can affect you from your head all the way to your toes. And if you think about hypothyroidism or your thyroid, it's like the thermostat for your body. So when it's hypo or low, things are going to run more slowly. And so that's what she's going to demonstrate for us today. Right. Okay. All right, Brittany. So one of the first uh, and worst symptoms of hypothyroidism is just being cold all the time. And no matter what you do, you can't get warm. If your family is comfortable and you are so cold. You wear two to three shirts, even in the summertime. You run the space heater next to your desk um, when the air conditioning is uh, going. Um, and so Brittany's demonstrating that with, the, with, the, um, with her coat and her hat. And you have cold hands and cold feet. Uh, the other thing is you may be so tired, you might be feeling like you're dragging a five-pound weight on your ankles. You know, there's no reason that you really should be that tired, but you just feel extremely uh, exhausted, even when you have been in the bed for eight hours. So uh, the ankle weights represents that. Five-pound bag of sugar, just representing that extra five to maybe 15 pounds that you put on, and you're not eating any differently, or you've tried to diet and you can't lose weight and you continue to um, gain weight. That's part of uh, a slow metabolism from the thyroid. And sometimes you just don't feel like yourself. So this represents not feeling like yourself and feel like you're going crazy sometimes. So telling it, being told that you're crazy. The other thing is your, your skin turnover is slow. So you have to take a bath in lotion every day to, to get your skin nice and moist. Um, also going back to head symptoms, if you might be told that you uh, are depressed. Uh, you may actually feel depressed, and so you're given a prescription for Prozac, when in reality, it might just be that it is your thyroid that needs adjusted. Also, uh, so tired in the morning that you're drinking a lot of caffeine or energy drinks or jolt or any of those sorts of things to get your day going. The next thing is your bowels. Because remember, everything is turned down really slowly, so your bowels don't move very well, so a lot of bloated. And then she has the X-Flex to represent that. I hope that you're not really using that, but um, people do. Uh, the other thing, sometimes trouble sleeping. So you're sleeping at the wrong time. So sleep aid might be in your medicine cabinet. And your hair, which is really huge for women. You're finding more hair in your brush and on the bathroom floor than you think that you have left in your head. And then you have a lot of hair products trying to make your hair look a little more healthy, a little more uh, fluffy, because the hair can look really brittle and dry. And the dreaded pad. So a lot of menstrual irregularities go along with hypothyroidism. Uh, it's going to be skip cycles, a couple cycles in a month, continuous bleeding, all sorts of different things, a very heavy bleeding at times. What else do you have in your box, Brittany? Oh, yeah. the fingernails. So dry, brittle nails. And so you may have a, uh, a bottle of the uh, kind of polish that makes your nails uh, stronger and or a, a bottle of biotin. People use that for hand, hair, skin, and nails. And okay. anything else? Uh -uh. Okay, because you can see it affects everything from your head to your toe, and it can really weigh you down. So if you would like to have your thyroid thoroughly ejected, uh, thoroughly checked, we will go over the labs next week and the next time that we do a video. Yeah, so I think that's it. Yep. Yeah, we've about covered everything, so make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel, like us on Facebook, um, give us a call, and thanks again for tuning Have in. Have a great weekend. Thank you.